Moog is officially ahead of me now. Wait, you played for four hours and you I'm ahead of you now? I'm only two hours in. Wait, we've already been playing for two hours? <laughs> Twisted wasn't lying! Time goes by fast, fast! I finally figured this survey thing out. We're not in old Atlantis. We are in new Atlantis. Wait, I can take my helmet off? Oh. I'm fine, right? And here's our new captain. My crew can take a look at your ship. And you can stop by to trade a So annoyingly vague. Is it? Okay. My ship needs some repairs. I think my ship is just fine. Where can I go if I need more crew for my I ship? Try to viewport. They'll be on your left once you get into the plaza. Everything looks good here. I'll be at my booth if you need me. Sounds good. Regular gravities. Look. Your watch beeps faster as you run out of protection. Oh. Hello, Mr. Technician. Anything I can help you with? Trade authority. What is this? Oh, this is your vendor. You can sell your stuff. Okay, that's nice. Sell that. I'm keeping things that I want to have in my house, okay? I don't want the chunks. I don't want this. I want that. I don't want the cylinder. Your samples, I can get out of here. Molecule extractor. Your sample screwdriver. I want that in my house. I only want one. Surgical bowl, syringe, tape measure, tissues. Vice grip. Okay. Resources. We should probably keep these for crafting. Should probably keep those. <sighs> it's NL. Who? Where? What? That's a good looking sandwich, I'm not gonna lie. The egg assistant? That's messed up. <laughs> I won't say anything, but... <laughs> Terrible. Helmets? The Chainsaw Man helmet? Wait, there's different packs? Boost pack? That's neat. I don't have any other spacesuits, though. Weps? I can sell... Do they get damaged or no, Twisted? Do you know? Or Razor? Either of yous? Not that I can tell. Okay, I'm gonna just sell for them. Uh, okay, so we sold some stuffs. That's cool. Uh, where do we have to go? I can assure you, this unprovoked attack on a United Colonies research facility will not go unanswered. We'll get you settled into your new assignments as soon as possible. Helena. For you, Bobby, that includes Richardo. Rick oh, Ricardo. Parents aren't dead. They just took a different shuttle. I'll see them when they get here. Bobby. Okay, he's oh. a little brat, you can tell. Well, of course. He looks like the That's do the roar possible. kid. <laughs> Security. Uh, we'll ju uh, we'll just... <clears throat> Helena Chambers. ID SSCOM 1327HCHA. I was the station. She needs a face punch. Anyway. Look at all the peepos. You can scan me all you'd like. Rick chart. <laughs> Stop. So many what all the people living for today. Gotta run soon. I'm late to a meeting. You should probably start running then, citizen. Huh? Ah, hi. I wanna go swimming. I don't like you can go through lily pads. You should have to jump over them. Look at all the humans! Hello! Citizen. They're all named the same, though. It's kind of lame. 
Your dreams. From stars to stars. A universe of leisure. What is this? New Atlantis information. Okay. Welcome to New Atlantis, the capital of the United Colonies, and for many, the settled systems as a whole. You stand now in the most technologically advanced city in the human race. The human race has ever conceived and constructed. New Atlantis was founded in the year 2156, the same year you first arrived in the Alpha Centauri star system. If you're a resident, then you're already familiar with your fantastic home. And if you're a visitor, you're an honored guest of the United Colonies and will be treated as such. Our courteous and professional security personnel will be found all over the city, and it's their job to ensure your time in New Atlantis is joyful, lawful, and protective. So as you stroll the streets or take the Nat train to the city's different districts, know that you are in the embrace of the United Colonies and couldn't be in better hands. Hmm. Oh, is this lore? Humans, Madge? What's wrong with humans? United Colonies as an entity was first established in the year 2159 on the planet Earth. Oh. As a means of unifying the human race as we spread amongst the stars, our goal was the peaceful exploration and colonization of space, working in harmony with anyone who wished to sail forth across the blackest of sea to new horizons. In 2161, we issued the Sitaris Proclamation, which formalized the colonization of distant worlds for anyone who wished to do so. Fortunately, not everyone shared in our dream. When wars erupted across the settled systems, the United Colonies stood steadfast, protecting humans and their right to fairly col colonize. It seems like, like wars just happen because humans are around, you know? Then, when our beloved home world was rendered inhabitable in the year 20 i thought that said 2023 and i was like does todd know something we don't know <laughs> my alignment is lawful joy oh yeah that's crazy the united colonists knew it was a, it had a sacred responsibility we were able oh, we were to be the keepers of the earth its artifacts its ideals its cultures its very people so while you stand now on the planet J on the planet jameson in the city of new atlantis on the alpha satari star system know that for all intents and purposes you are still very much on earth and earth takes care of its own this is fantastic i'm glad i i chose this place chimpanzees are known to have wars Really? Are there frogs in this game? These are valuable questions I need answers to. I'm not gonna lie. Oh yes, there's a train. Hello. Hi. Why'd she all wide-eyed at me? What? Why is everybody looking at me like that? Look, give me the side eye. Who do you think you are? Yeah. In my country, this is okay. <laughs> yeah, see? Hello. This is New Atlantis Transit, or the it provides free transportation throughout the city. We can take it directly to the Mast District. Because Chloe's drip is awful. You're right, you're right. But they said I can't take- 69. They said I couldn't take it off, so I was like, oh. What's the drippiest hat we have? Okay, probably- I like this one, I like this one. Which jumpsuit do we like though? I like I like the minor utility outfit. I think this is okay. This seems fine to me. The hoodie is nice. You like the blue raincoat? Why does she kind of look like Jennifer Lawrence? How you like that laser gun? Pew pew. <laughs> pew pew. I want to go to the mast district. Gotta rep the chunks, exactly. The frogs per hour of Starfield has so far been pretty low for Moog standards. Yeah, I, I I do have to say, Todd, I have one complaint so far. Where are the frogs? I want this drip. Everybody seems to have this drip, and I'd like it. Is this how people dress in the future, I think? And they just disappear like that? Another day, another credit. So true. Yo, sushi! I'd like some of that. Does that say moist? Mast, okay. O2 is consumed with exertion such as sprinting, melee attacks, and jumping. Oh, interesting, okay. Come on, buddy, get in here. Get get in here, buddy. Come on. Okay. Um, let's go to I don't know, where are we going? The lobby? Let's go to the lobby. That impressive building is mast. 
Deep military, administrative, and scientific triumvirate. It stands as a symbol of the United Colonies. Oh. Todd, what have you done? Oh no, are they, is this a mall? Todd? What is this? What 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 is that? What is happening? What is this? Oh Jesus. You know what? We're going to check out the mall. I don't care. I'm not in a rush. Are you in the rush? No, because we've got all goddamn day. Swimmer. Can we go to space suppose? <laughs> Get some space pizza. You ran out of O2. Further exertion will cause CO2 buildup. Oh, oops. Okay, so you can't swim for a long time. That actually makes a lot of sense. Move, how are you liking the game so far? I am having an absolute blast. Listen, I'm a Bethesda junkie as it is. Um, quite frankly, I... What do you mean you feel underdressed? Citizen. Um, I, I will enjoy anything pretty much that is put out. And I've been, I've been looking forward to this for a long time. Like a new hire stumbling through their first day. And who exactly are you? I'm waiting for the day that a video game gets mouth movements correctly. Is it? It's probably hard to animate. I'll give them that. It's just funny seeing it sometimes. Just a starship captain seeing what new Atlantis has you. to offer. Huh. You have your own ship. Why does that surprise you, oh, Landry? Perfect. Kismet, really. What does kismet mean? I have a business proposition for you that could. Uh, I came to check out a mall, not out. talk to you. Very lucrative. It means fat. You're buttering me up pretty thick. <laughs> so you see right through me. <laughs> you got kismet equal. Oh, fate. Oh. You are just the person I'm looking for. Now, What's my name then? Time, huh? I might just be a little desperate. See, the world of credit analysis, you know, dealing with deadbeats and reprobates is, uh, well, it's a tough field. Probably. And what I need is a ringer. So Someone you're telling me now, in space fallout, delinquent offenders. you but can have a job? You. You work with me. Bro has a shiny See, nose. His nose is quite shiny. Huge. He needs those oil blotting things. Distractingly shiny. Kind of is. Let's just look at the desk. Let's look down. Tell me about the mark then. How many credits are we talking about? Oh, I can tell you're eager. That's good. But we'll start small. We'll Here, look, we'll just replace my works. face over his. There. Now you don't see his nose. What's so difficult with death? <laughs> death <laughs> get noticed. that collection. Hey, get out of here. Nobody wants to see your face. <gasps> look, we're sitting together. Big. Like really big. Someone he looks like a Ken doll. Water, like a really washed up Ken doll. <laughs> It's a real pain to track them down. <laughs> Sad truth is, we can't track everyone down. You're on so his lap. Analysis always has a black eye. And what are you going to do about it? <laughs> um, tell me about Mark then. Yes. The Mark. So, we got a galaxy class comment. For Christmas? To a I want another frog. Turns out, surprise, it was a And the tank, because quite frankly, they're expensive. <laughs> system. Now, he's holed up. In a literal shack in the middle of nowhere. I thought he said a literal shat, and I was like, a what? <laughs> uh, the job is simple. Get Dieter to pay. And we don't want him dead. We don't want him hurt. Just close his account like an honest citizen. Is he dangerous? Well, I mean, yes. We're not the only ones looking for What him. size tank? It needs to be 18 by 18 by 24. Unless you're serious That's like expensive. Civic responsibilities. What happens if he dies? If he dies, then his assets go to probate, and we can get paid. So if he forces you into an it's you or him situation, foreshadowing, it's that's what's going to happen. Cal Bank bottom line, if you choose him. But I cannot stress this enough. This is not the ideal outcome. We wanted him liquidated. We'd have put a tracker on him. Uh, let's let's call. I'll I can't say no, so. Details. I hate to end on this note, but, you know, not everyone's a straight arrow. You cut a deal with Dieter. Honestly, I have no way of knowing. But don't expect any... I guess is what it means. Me. We prefer a live, but debt is acceptable. Just smaller rewards if you whack them. I came to the mall. I want to go to the mall. 
What do you mean floor access restricted? What the hell? I want to go to the mall. Let me go to the mall. What is Outland? Let me in. Hello, I'm here to purchase your goods. Well, you're only as safe as your equipment out there. Who is this? Welcome to Outland. We Chat, it's Tom Ellis. I need to leave. Reliable gear I gotta go. Adventures may await you. All of our products come highly recommended by individuals who have devoted their lives to distant travel. And while I've never needed them myself, I stand by everything we offer. Hmm, no, and no flying for me. Not not my style. Yes, by all means, have a look. <laughs> Let me have a look. What do you have? Let me see your stuff. I have one of those. Where's a where's just blue? I want full blue. Can you cut? Okay, here's a question. Todd, can you customize your spacesuit and make it look how you want? Because I think that would be lovely. Just like you can with power armor. Just saying. That's a cool one. Apparel. You know what? I kind of like this jumpsuit. This is pretty neat. Although I look like a mechanic, but that's fine. I'll come back. You've never really been to space? Goodness, no, I just couldn't. You're out there millions of I miles can't cope. away from anything. Look, let me sit and let me let me just wrong. I can't stop the thought. <laughs> I prefer solid ground under my feet at all times. I want and his outfit. Probably a hot fresh coffee within reach. Can't get those in space either. You can on my ship. I do. In this line of work, it's essential, don't you think? Why is he talking to me on the side? He's like only suggest that they're not satisfied. It's his good business. side, that's why. <laughs> but that whatever they purchased had failed, leaving them unable to return. I would not be able to sleep at night if I thought that were the case. Is he Henry Cavill here? I mean, he's an animated character, so it's hard to say. <laughs> Listen, look. Just look at the features and... <laughs> Good luck on all your adventures. Thank you. What kind of pants are you wearing? Sorry about... Sorry, sorry. You know, this guy is, he's a metro metrosexual, is that what y'all called him? I would never dream of selling <laughs> standard gear. Outland has standards and I uphold them. See you later. <sighs> Wait, you can inspect? What's a demos? Hello. Hi, how's it going? Hello? Hi, hello. Hey there. Hey yeah, there. How's it going? Let me- can you get the heck out of my way? I'm going back in. I want to inspect the hog. <gasps> He's standing up reading a book. How do you inspect? Can I inspect you? If there's anything you need, please. <laughs> sorry, 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 sorry. I can just take your water pitcher? Thank you. <laughs> vile. Vile, vile. Okay, let's... Oh, oh, I see. I see what you mean. This isn't the mall. I've been lied to. It sure looks like one. Is this the mall? You look completely different. How can I help you in Enhance myself today. Hello, Warner Connell. Welcome to Enhance. Thanks so much for stopping in today. I'm sure my staff and Okay, I his mouth movements are very good. Me. If you're here to try something new or on a whim, or to replicate a look you've seen and loved elsewhere, or just want to love your reflection in the mirror a little bit more, we've got you covered. No, like, the mouth movements aren't bad. I, I've definitely seen worse. Like, you know in, um, the quarry? It was very uncanny. It was kind of creepy. 500 credits? 
I'm glad you take patient confidentiality seriously. A breach of information can be a major problem for your business. Oh my god. You certainly put things bluntly, don't you? Yes, I do. I did. Uh, no, I, I do. Get intimidated, I, I, I fool. Very seriously. <sighs> Sorry. He's got a little bit of a drunk gaze. A he does. Guard. To tell you the truth, I made a bit of a slip. Why do these people share I these things with strangers? A data containing the confidential information <laughs> of numerous patients. You don't have a security? People, the, 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 the staff? Done age, birthdays, <laughs> mailing addresses. Oh no, who am I kidding? This is so bad. <laughs> these people if overshare way too much. Out, my business and reputation could be destroyed. No patient will trust me again. Sounds like you're irresponsible and bad at your job. Well, that certainly it's isn't not. good. People's private information is at stake, ready to be taken by any bad actor that finds that damn slate. You don't say. And worse, my reputation and business is on the line. Please, I'm begging you. You just you met me. To find what if slate? I'm a hacker and I'm going to use that information and I'm going to sell it to companies for millions of dollars? <laughs> I'll find it. Where have you visited? Yes. Did you go to the mall by any chance? Thank you. And let's see, I, I frequent the terror brew nearby. As well as whetstone, I also stop by the Valberg Whetstone, that's the things that help you change your weapon art in, in Elden Ring, you isn't it? Life -saver. Or the type of blade Please, it is? Come back as soon as you have the slate. Please oh, pick two. Don't oh. read anything on it. <laughs> it's confidential stuff. Remember? I'm definitely gonna read it. Come back anytime. Yeah, to have my information stolen? No thanks, buddy. Can they see me? I wish you could see, if they could see you. Oh, shite. We're still friends? <gasps> oh, Jesus Christ. Security, stop! You're making things harder for yourself. You're under arrest. Sudden moves. Here. God damn it! How it's 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 body lotion. Is his skin that crusty? And we've already gone to prison chat. Dang. Scientist out in front of mast, staring at trees. Sounds upset. Whatever it is, it can't be that bad. What'd you do? Right? Hey. I have nothing to say. That's fine. Hang on, I'm just trying to get out of here. <laughs> Officers needed. I'll be a police officer. Just don't arrest me again, man. <laughs> I already got arrested. No. Now are we by the mall? And my mother wanted me to be a doctor. A doctor. <laughs> Mother's in the red. So true. You'll be scanned. Scan me, I dare you. You'll regret it. Um, oh, so like the police station is literally right. Oh, hotel and shopping. Okay, okay, okay. Now I can see things. Moop two hours ago? That's easy. I simply won't get a bounty. Oh, uh, now we're going to the mall. Let's get crunk first. Let's buy a drink, naturally, as you go into a new city. Let me know if I can get you anything. You are beautiful. Hey there. Hello. Always nice to see a new face. First time. Nice to meet you too, sweet cheeks. Can I get a drink off you? <laughs> oh, yeah. And yet here we are. Only just meeting for the first time. Did you say crunk? Who Tell says that? What, Everybody in Winnipeg. Girl, I'll give you one on the house. And she gave us a free drink. What's the word around town? You know, I had a guy in here last week ranting that General Shao ought to send the Marines down into the well. I'm usually all for letting folks speak their minds. Winnipeg stuck in 2009. True. After a few drinks, but that was just too much. <laughs> in Anybody the cell. stuck living in the well, it almost certainly isn't by choice. You. And things down there aren't that bad. <laughs> what are you in for? I killed two men. How about you? I stole a soap dispenser. <laughs> <laughs> yep. 
Welcome to Canada. Heard any good rumors I lately? Hear some sort of citizens group trying to get the old Varun embassy torn down. When I first heard about it, I thought it was a bit extreme, but mm. really, would you want to move into that place? Me neither. Totally no. And it's not like they're ever coming back. House Varun, I mean. Well, at least not. So wait, if you choose a different like we all know how that went. home where you're from in your traits, do you go somewhere else or do you go to New Atlantis anyway? You bought me a drink, so I'm gonna drink it. Let me let me let me drink it. What did she give me though? New arrival. Drinky drinky. Okay. Oh, I thought it was gonna stay like that. Huh? Hi, how are you? I'm good. Can you look at me when you're talking to me? Thank you. <laughs> you like living here? Oh, sure. There's always tons of travel into New Atlantis, so there's no shortage of people to meet. She's Australian! I love talking with the new people and hearing about their journeys. Not to mention, it's also nice and safe. Also. Unlike my brother's job. I was just looking at this nice soap dispenser. And wouldn't you know it? Ended up in my pocket, don't you know? Oh boy, I tell ya, the owner sure was fired about it. <laughs> uh, she's just met me and is trauma dumping. I understand. Are you worried about of your brother? Course. He's a marine stationed in Sidonia. My whole family is worried about him. She's pissed. My dad worked his butt off so that we could all have safe jobs here in New Atlantis. But New Atlantis. Chris went off to Sidonia the first chance he got. He says he's okay, and that he loves his job and all that. But I don't think he understands how hard this is on our family. That is the most self selfish thing I've ever heard in my life. Let him do what he loves. Forehead. It's not my problem that you're not having a good time working at your local smitties, okay? Maybe the tips aren't so well. Find something you love. Don't crap on your brother because he found something. Jeez Louise. <sighs> He'll be fine. I hope you're right. I just have such a What dialogue choice would a stranger have to pick to unlock your side quest? But, oh my. I'm sorry. I didn't <laughs> mean to dump all of that onto you. Um it just feels good to get it all off my chest. Sir, not in the not in public! Not in public! <laughs> Simeon! You picked a good day to drop by. Bartender's making them strong today. You in uh, town for business? Is this a Canadian? <laughs> The bartender's making a strong one right now. <laughs> I like this guy. Um, just here for one of those strong drinks you're talking about. Cheers. Nothing like a cold one after a long trip through the space lanes, if you ask me. He's so Canadian. It seems like we have that in common. Personally, I'm here looking for work. I just quit my job as a weapon tester for Mask. Want to come... I'm looking for people well, to join damn, my crew. What a coincidence. Working on a ship sounds perfect. I was Working on a ship sounds perfect. What's your offer? 12,000 credits? Would you consider working less than the standard I'm rate? A reasonable guy, but that's just too low. Do I need a shower or something? <laughs> so sad. No. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm poor. <laughs> I can't afford you, Simeon. I'm broke. <laughs> if I do a dance, we'll, we'll, can we get a look? Now he's drinking. I've just put a man into a really bad yes. situation. You gonna drink that? <laughs> Let me go shopping. That This doesn't look like shopping to me. You took me to a bar and that's it. Is this all you have to offer? This is like Winnipeg. Oh, welcome to Winnipeg. All we have is bars and clubs. Look, now I'm now I'm mad. I'm kicking everything off your table. Yeah, look at that. Your drink okay. spilled. Hello. <laughs> Barrett enjoys this establishment. He frequently buys chocolate here, though I have informed him repeatedly. It is likely a significant contributing factor to his Oof. being overweight. Jesus Christ. Tesco has no filter. 
Hello. If you don't see what you want, feel free to ask. Chocolate. An exotic bottle. Oh my god. Hi. Hello, Amoli. Hi there. Thanks for stopping in. Feel free to look around. I can take care of transactions, and if you've got questions, just ask. Go off, Tesco. I'd like to see what you oh, have please, for sale. Take a look. She's adorable. Okay, what do you have? A sidearm. A pistol. That's expensive. I don't need ammo. What spacesuits do you have? The same old, same old. It's just it's everybody's got the same thing. What food do you have? Bread. <laughs> Straight cheese. Mmm. Whiskey? It's an apple juice bottle, but it's whiskey. That's crazy. Med pack. Man bread. This is making me want to want some man bread, I will say. It's not even pre-cut? What the heck? You have to cut your bread? That's messed up. Synthetic chicken and meat. Deal. Where's, where's this chocolate he was speaking of? I don't see no chocolate. You know what? Just because I will buy a baguette. I like the idea of just walking around the, the city business. eating an entire baguette. Am I allowed in here? I am not a stock boy. I am That's crazy, Gerard. I didn't ask. Wow, look at all this junk. Crazy. I don't understand what chocolate Tesco was talking about. I think he just wanted a reason to BM. Now that it's Dan's birthday, rumor has it he's hosting 596Con in 40. <laughs> I want all of this chocolate. It doesn't let me take it though. Messed up. <gasps> Dripper. The drip that I I can't buy. That's fine. Coffee. Sure hope your day's going as well as mine. Small decision, but they all add up over time. And... What was that? <sighs> it's nothing like an afternoon off. His voice sounds very familiar. What? <laughs> I love I love Wish. sipping <laughs> liquor through no, a bendy straw. <laughs> Just moved in, actually. My girlfriend and I got a place there a few weeks ago. Aww. I'm not sure how long we'll be there, though. We're saving up to get Room out of here. Room 40s. Oh, Sam Enjoy Exotic. Systems. That sucks that you got me. That actually kind of sucks. <laughs> Tell me more about your girlfriend. Yeah, sure. Her name's Donna. She works at the Nat Station near Mast. Okay. Oh. Boy, is she a catch. She's passionate, beautiful, friendly. Aww. I really like Sounds like Jesse Pinkman, but out of breath. We met a couple True. years ago, and uh, we've been going steady since then. Aww. I'm actually thinking about asking her to marry me pretty soon. You should, and uh, then I'm gonna come find her and steal her from us, you. Okay. But only once you're married. I don't want her finding out before I pop the question. Aww, how's your day going? Uh, fine, I guess. Do we know each other? Okay, wait. So, hang on. I just asked him about his wife, and he started gushing. Um. Dominic, hello! You beat the Guardian 8 today? Fight was AIDS! Don't know if I'll be able to work next week because I'm getting your blood filtered. <laughs> no! How many attempts did it take here? Did you lose count after 50? Checks out. Okay, no, 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 but this guy just gushed his heart about his girlfriend to me. But I ask, how's your day? And now I'm pushing a line. Anything I'm just all right. Yeah, no, I'm just confused why you're so triggered that I asked how your day was. Oh, all right. <laughs> I'm trying to find this guy's I'm not wife. Trying to flirt with me. <laughs> no. My day's going fine. It's hard to complain about anything when you have a terror brew in your hand. Catch you later, yeah. Catch you later, yeah. Uh, yep, heard you the first. Time. That's wild. Okay. Excuse me. Yes. I'd like some coffee. Took me twelve. I could teach you the strat. Fight after is even worse than the ape. Oh god. I mean, phase two just stinks. I want a macchiato. Thank you. I wish I could carry it around. I want to carry around my macchiato. People, look at people forgetting their mugs and their drinks. What? I can't even take it without getting in trouble? That's Minkus. Humanity reaches the stars, but they're still weighed down by their devastating caffeine addiction. Such a sad story. Yeah, isn't that, no kidding, right? 
All I wanted was a Gucci store, and I didn't even get that. Wait, there's a second floor? Hold, please. I think I could live on coffee if I had to. Go find your girlfriend, home dog. Okay, here we go. Waterfall promenade. Humanity reaches the store. Still wait down. I mean, to be fair, we also still have whiskey, which is just crazy to me. I'm just waiting for cigarette. No, wait, it would be vapes. It would be vapes. Cigarettes will be obsolete by this time. Oh, Razor, are you still here? Does the view look correct? Hello, citizen. Why is there no stores up here? I was under the expectation that I would find more shopping. His girlfriend is a cup of coffee. <gasps> you figured it out. Yikes. Do you think you can jump on trees? Probably not, probably not. I'm jealous, I gotta wait till Friday to play. I have such a big backlog of games, it's not a big deal. I oh, use that baguette for big DPS. True, just smack people with the baguette. So I thought I was gonna have to wait till Friday because Steam was like, oh, it's available September 5th. And I'm like, uh, what? <laughs> but it's fine, it's here. All downloaded and good to go. Wait, this is Spaceport? Then what's the top thing? Hold, please. The well. Oh, no, I don't want to go down to the well. Okay, so that, that's all the shopping, huh? Coffee? I mean, it makes sense, to be fair. Universe of Leisure. Okay, so take this. Mast District. Ugh. Okay, so I have to go that way. Again and again and again! What's in here? What's the point of this? Oh! Get in here, Tesco. Attaboy. <laughs> Is this the correct place? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Let's go back down. Uh oh. Oh, <sighs> just violent. <sighs> League of Independent Settlers. So long as it's in the same system. The same well, system. Way, can... French? Bonjour, comment ça va? It's quite aesthetically pleasing. Or so Barrett has told me. Tesco! New Atlantis relies on advanced hydroelectrics for most of its power. Look at all these people. Sergeant Yumi is looking for reliable people to help the guard. That's crazy. Contact him if you're interested. We'd all it. I am simply here just trying to live life. Okay. This reminds me of the Institute, by the way. I have we one goal. in a United Colonies city, but Constellation is an entirely neutral entity and always has been. Huh. Look at that. They actually have garbage cans and stuff. Ugh. Oh, beautiful. Here we are. The lodge. The front door should unlock if you hold up the watch that Barrett gave you. Are we gonna get a close up of the arm? The other members of Constellation. <laughs> How do I know? Inside. I'm telling you, Bethesda and their arm thing that they've got going on. I love it. I'm in. <gasps> Captain Chloe. Everyone will be in the library. Just inside. If Barrett were here, Marie Callender's knows that you may not have time to roll out dough for a perfectly flaky cook. This place, your home. So wait, I just live here? 
the library. Hello? Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Hello, Sarah. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? Why is she the base character for Chloe, though? <laughs> <laughs> uh, pirates attacked. Barrett asked me to do this. I see. Yeah. Vasco, verify. It's Tesco, All thank you. made have been factual. Uh, this is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted He on looks like a Walter, you know? I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. She's here with the artifact. Thank that looks you, like the Brotherhood Richard. suit now, that they were under their power. Let's focus on what's in front of us. I know she doesn't Alan. even know Tesco's name. Isn't that messed what up? What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? Yeah, I went on this crazy yeah. acid trip. How many times has this happened? I'm gonna answer the question we with a question. It's anyone else who pulls one out of the rock for the first time? Why? We're not sure yet. So if you wouldn't mind adding another data point. Bright lights and music. <laughs> Similar to Barrett's description of the experience, with less embellishment. Are you hearing this? Do you all believe me now? Whether it happened or not wasn't in doubt. But honestly, Kyle, if you expect us to believe in fairy... If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But gentlemen, can we please focus? Noel, I think it's time we tested your theory. Look at that. They right. look like the same person. We know the artifacts react to each other. Ah, eh, similar. I altered the face, though. Move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this new <clears throat> thing to the two we already have... The artifact. If you could place it on the table here. Um... I like the leather jacket. Where can I get that? He looks like he goes to restaurants, asks for fine <laughs> recommendations, takes a sip and spits it only confirm he wants another one. That's True. It. Just That's sprint out. It's my artifact. Imagine. We thought there were only two of them at first. Oh my god. That's it. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. They are. That energy that's arcing between them, no manufactured material in the settled systems can do that. None of them. This proves that. Easy, girl. You'll have a hunt attack. That was She's very reassuring. Wow. Oof. Together, that means there's a set built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, Patrick. You're on, Walter. Well, if we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting. Now, would it? Ain't that the truth? Take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend? Oh, I hope I can sleep here. <laughs> So, I don't like that giggle. Work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours. Little. I'm in. You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members aren't here, but you'll meet them soon. Who's going to be my designated Starfleet streamer? Find me when you're ready. Walking riot. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Get your feet wet. And here. I think you've earned something for bringing the artifacts. Cheese? To us. Give me cheese. In addition to credits, why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need it out in the field anyway. Okay, I'm in. Just mind your head. Don't get down. They were just waiting around. That sound. Smash? Can yeah. I... Say say no more. I'm in. Sarah Morgan? That sounds like a very common name. Let me in your door. Yeah, Walter. Can I to eat this sandwich? I'll eat it. Thank you. It's true. I am away from home quite a bit. I'm told that when I'm not here, I'm distracted by what I might be missing and wind up crabby. Or my worst favorite, irascible. My wife Hi. Is if you've got questions. It is speak up looks like Miles Teller. My time to our We're all here, here for the same reason. Nice work. Here's a jetpack. Okay? 
I'm not sure anyone really asked you. Don't want you to think we're focused on the artifacts and nothing else. You matter too. You've done something really significant bringing that artifact here. I'm Mateo, theological Hi. scholar by trade, but now, well, an explorer. Everyone has very you. shiny noses. It's really good to have you with us. What do you make of the vision I saw? I'm not gonna lie, I really wish I could have seen this for myself. It's hard to judge otherwise. Both you and Barrett saw something. Must be the style. Yeah, wet noses. Maybe it's in now. Did it feel like it was trying to tell you something? No. I don't want to necessarily use the words divine revelation, but you know, if the label fits. Um. I know it's important. I can feel it. It has to be, right? Totally. All of this is connected. We just need to figure. I want to know what like they do for their skincare in in this game because nobody this. has a we single pimple, data, not a single spot. <laughs> uh, who brought you to Constellation? Well, there was some overlap in interests. I'd spent years searching for religious relics from human history. Hmm. I had made a really incredible. There's no discovery, dirt in space. The vacuum of space sucks out all the blankets. <laughs> you. So I tried to steal it back. In the process, I met Walter. Turned out he owned the corporation. Mm. After a long talk, Leech we code set nose wetness sniffer. And I was invited to join Constellation. Wow. That's cool. Take care of yourself. You too, buddy. I don't want to talk to you. I want to talk to Sarah. Wait, is there anybody else I can talk with? I hope you are satisfied with the quarters available to you. Oh, well, I have to go look at it, Tesco. Let me go check it out first. Locked. Locked. With is my room. Door. Door. But can I pick my room or are they- Bar! Oh my god! It's beautiful! Open. Okay, but which is my- Okay, that one's owned. Wow, there sure is a lot, huh? Oh wait, that's that room. Huh. Owned? Well, somebody doesn't make their bed. What a slob. A turlet? Okay. Door. Owned. I'm liking this whole setup here. That's cute. Uh. I hope this isn't me. Okay, owned. <laughs> Moog and Sarah sitting in the tree. T T L A L K I N G. Where's my bedroom? I want a place to sleep. I don't think it's very fair I have to look this far to find somewhere to sleep. Nope. Not cool, people. Not cool at all. Can't sleep in an own bed. Am I in, like, the back corner or something? Of course I am. Of co The last room that I look... That would be my bedroom, huh? Messed up. A watch case? I'll leave it. I'll, I'll keep my watch. What's in the dresser, though? Storage. Beautiful. Alright. The weps. Because these are always the heaviest, the weapons. Look at this guy. Look, look. This, is, this thing's heavy as heck. I don't like... Um, I'll keep the shank. I don't like SMGs, personally. Wait, there's aliens? I didn't even think of that aspect. Oh, Christ. Sleep on the floor, newbie? <laughs> Mugwan's pistols and swords? I mean, I wouldn't say no. I'll keep both just in case. Um, we'll put this hat away, the chunks. Um, that helmet can go. And the trucker. Mm. We'll keep that. Keep those. Keep that. Wait, does the ammo weigh anything? No, it doesn't. Okay. Um, that is a drug. I'll keep the bread. Bitten sandwich. Cola. <laughs> straight up celery. Uh, chocolate. Beer. That's Henry food right there. Heel paste. Mm. Midnight delight. Sandwich or macchiato. Uh, the 
pack me okay that's fine notes they don't weigh anything resources we should probably put these away for now ew that's disgusting uh, we'll put the the heavy things away we'll just put it all away for now that's fine why do we have so much money did you see that oh we can put our room stuff away damn it did we all put it did we put it all away Frick, hang on, hang on. Inventory. Misc. <laughs> we did not. Drop, 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 and a water pitcher. Beautiful. Okay, let's start putting stuff where it belongs, shall we? Like this, this globe, for example. Damn it. Plop it right there. Beautiful. And then and then these sphere toys. I need to go first person for this. There we go. That makes it easier, doesn't it? The sphere toys can go there. Uh damn it. No. Our egg assistant, we're gonna put on our bedside table so it can watch us sleep. <laughs> put it right there. Beautiful. Tissues. No. Okay, water pitcher. Uh, we'll put that uh, the right up here. Yep. Um, pencil case. Oops. Okay, so it is the same for the rotation. Pencil case. We're gonna just plop right right on here. Ugh. Okay, the new thin. See you an hour when we leave this room. What do you mean? I'm just done decorating. I'm decorating. It's okay. Board game. Cradle tissues. There we go. Okay, we're just gonna put this right here. Uh, tissues. We'll just put on the on the bedside table. I almost sit on the bed. Tissues, hello. Thank you. Uh, we might have to just put them on the bed, actually, because there's no space, so we'll just plop them there. Um, I cry a lot in bed, apparently. Um, crouch down. <laughs> we'll put this, this right here. Okay. <gasps> Jesus Christ! <laughs> No, okay, so it does that. Uh, let's drop it. Now it should be fine. Aha! Knew it. Nope. <laughs> it's tweaking. Put it there. What if they made a fig Newton cradle? What does that mean? What do you mean a fig cradle? Um, skill issue. Skill issue. It's it's tough to figure this out. Death Metal, how are you? Are you or have you already restarted Armored Core? You know what? That's how globes work. There we go, chat. Look at that. We have our own bedroom already set up and good to go. Do they not have fig Newtons in Canada? I don't know what that is. I mean, we may have them. I'm just unaware of them. What time is that? 4.37? Wait, 12... 2 minutes... Wait, 2 hours, 5 minutes UT? What does this mean? What are all these units? Okay, now I have to figure out how to go get back to Sarah. Like this. Back from a meeting? How'd your meeting go? Is that the SpongeBob SquarePants guy? All right, Sarah. In before this is a wrong room, it just happens to be an unowned bed. No, oh, don't say that. Are you ready to get to work? Or was there something else? Tesco. Uh, no, I don't need anything. Just uh, checking in. Tesco, you're my Same friend. You're doing. At present, all systems are functioning. Well. We're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work. Detective. The artifacts are relatively. I'm a detective now. That means people can pass them around, not even knowing what they are. 
I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually. But a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. Hmm. Frog detective? I have to admit. My first mission. Not the same way when I started, too. There's an electricity in the air. I'm gonna you detect so hard. Something. <laughs> exactly. But it's not just that. I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself. And for you what to if I die on the missions? I'm going to be sticking <laughs> Survival of the fittest? <gasps> we'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. What about Tesco? What about, what about Tesco? Got it. We'll need to head to Mast. Check Tesco, I'm going to miss you. Office where my contact works. And listen, whatever you were before or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doorstep. Oh, I already Every got arrested. Don't worry. That's out of the way now. Understood. Understood. Good. You're supposed to... No. Let's take After I say understood, you're supposed to say outstanding. Test, I'll miss you, Tesco. I am at your service, Captain. I trust you're still satisfied with your choice to join Constellation, Noel. It's a dream come true, Sarah. You know that. Okay, chat. I'm, uh, I'm going to take a quick five-minute break to uh, so, uh, make a sandwich because it's now 3.30 somehow. I am at your service, Captain. I know, Tesco. You're the goodest of boys. Um, we're besties with security? Yeah, they know us real well. Uh, but I'm going to go make a sandwich real quick. Okay, talk to Sarah's contact. I hope you are satisfied with the quarters available to you. Oh, I am, Tesco. Don't even worry. Typical mouse and keyboard buttons. Okay. Can I jump over this fence? I can. A moog sandwich to me is meat, cheese, and all the mayo. Why is that literally what my sandwich is, though? That guy's a really good voice. So I feel all my teammates are playing on COD one-handed while eating. <laughs> That's how I play COD. Yo, Call of Duty Vanguard. Sarah, good to see you. Who's your friend? Hello, John. Uh, another space explorer. Hey, you ever think of joining up with the Vanguard? Help the United Colonies, earn some credits, even get your UC citizenship? Oh, sorry, but no. UC citizenship is all earned based on service. Hmm? They should have covered this in your civic lessons. Go figure. One-handed, eating, barking dog, crying baby in the background, headphones on backwards, sniffing and coughing directly into mic online. Multiplayer time. <laughs> What's the Vanguard? United Colonies volunteer fleet. Independent captains enlist, get to use their own ships, and the UC provides them with sustained work and credits. And put in your time, and you're guaranteed UC citizenship and everything that comes with it. Discounts on UC goods and medical services, chance to own a place in New Atlantis. Only way a foreign captain could even dream of seeing those sorts of benefits. So, you want in? I'm in. Oops. 
Uh, another space explorer. Sorry. Hey. Sorry. I'd love to join. Excellent. Just need to do a little paperwork. An orientation on the UC, and knock out an exam, and a probationary mission. An exam? Need to know I always fail exams. After all. Do well. You'll be out there keeping the peace in no I don't time. perform well under don't pressure. Forget, Joan. I need her back. When it's testing my knowledge. In that fancy get up of yours. No worry, Sarah. I'm not forgetting about you or our little business afterwards. Promise. First things first. Head down to the orientation hall. Get signed up at the registration terminal. The system will walk you through the rest. Oh, and if you got a bounty, well, you're going to have to make things right with the UC before we'll let you join. <laughs> but if you've got any questions, well, I can get you sorted. No mounty here. I just, um, I got arrested pretty quick when I landed here. No big deal, though. Something wrong with the exam? Right. Got so wound up bringing you on board, I almost forgot. <laughs> oh, I haven't. Come on, John. Let's hear it before you try to convince her to join the Marines. All right. Here's what I've got. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol system. Which admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. I have a metal spine. Matches that description Sarah gave me. Soul system is a lot of planets, but a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. It's definitely a lifestyle, burning helium out there, seeing where the stars take you. How was the sandwich, Boop? Banana, egg, and chorizo, I assume? Chorizo, ham, and egg. Um, it was a good sandwich. It was actually serve a lot salami and cheese and mayo, and that's it. Moog wearing a backless spacesuit to show off her fancy shiny spine leading to a lethal accident the first time she goes for a spacewalk. No! Been a long time since I've been to Mars. Soul system doesn't get a lot of traffic. Mind if I ask some personal questions? Fine by me. Do you have any religious beliefs? We're getting right into My it. My parents considered themselves to be enlightened, but their lives were so busy they rarely pursued their beliefs. By the time I was old enough to start questioning these things, the idea of following any organized religion was almost an afterthought. It's <laughs> not that I don't want to believe in anything. It's that my scientific mind is often at odds with my spiritual center. Interesting. Having been out there in the star field. Uh, she said the thing! All those magnificent wonders with my own eyes. I need answers, not religious theory. I'm sorry if that disappoints you. But don't worry. While we're on this journey together, I she fully said it to respect your religious beliefs. She put that perfectly. Wow. Exploration is my entire life. I consider it both a career and recreation. You know what, sir? Being said, I like you. I will make a confession, but you have to promise <gasps> to keep it between us. Of course. Before I graduated from school, I was in a band. And no, I don't mean the school band. I mean a rock band. We called ourselves Ironic Comet. <laughs> A ridiculous name, I know, but uh, we were just a bunch of teenagers getting together and having fun. Huh. And before you ask, no, I wasn't the lead singer. Oh. I actually played the drums. What? The band never really went anywhere, of course, but those were good times. Aww. And I remember them fondly. I love that everybody just overshares with you, but then gets upset when you ask how their day is. You mean, apart from being the chair of Constellation for the past five years? Mm-hmm. Well, let's see. I pride myself with my aptitude for astrodynamics, calculating optimal trajectories for grab jumping. That's been quite useful in the past. And as far as planetary exploration, my area of expertise is botany. So, don't worry. 
I won't let you eat anything that might put you in the hospital. That's good. I hope you got something out of that. I did. Talk to you later. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's night time. Brown outs all the time. Mast finally sent someone down there, but nothing's changed. <laughs> you got Sarah essaying if you ask her about her younger years or be religious beliefs, but if you ask a guy outside a coffee shop how his day is, you almost end up in jail. Make it make sense. Are those birds or sirens? Do I have to go around? Back to two hand play. <laughs> Pardon me. If you don't have official business, we ask you remain in the lobby. Yeah, eat it. Um. I I don't know what the correct office, what the correct place is. I think those are frogs. Well, we have to go find it though. I just got an email from Tim Horton saying that scan and pay to win is about to start. I miss when it was roll up the rim. I miss roll up the rim. But then people are like, ugh, germs. Well, don't go biting other people's cups then. I'm not- No, I wiped my hand, sicko. And it wasn't chorizo. <laughs> um, where are we going? The orientation hole. Is this correct? Why are you running, girl? Nope. No, I want to do the orientation hall. This was a quest, wasn't it? Oh, wait. No, I want to make sure I want to be in the military before I just go go get in there, you know? Oh, I want- Oh, it literally shows you where you have to go. Okay. I want to see what the inside of the train looks like. Because I'm nosy like that. Look at that, a dirty floor. Uh, what happened here? I've been trying to exercise more and eat healthier. But I feel like it helped if I had a couple cheat days. Go for it. Just do it, girl. Cheat days are exist oh, for a reason. That statue. It's beautiful, isn't it? By Victera, by Victera, by I wonder what the artist was trying to represent. I can't believe There he is! Is it you? Is it really, really you? Captain of the frontier, bane of the fleet. He's here, chat. Constellations shining, star of stars. <laughs> it's us, chat. <laughs> Thoughts three and a half hours in. Cade, obsessed. Oh, you are definitely the brightest, biggest star in any constellation. There's no navies about it. Why does he kind of look like Human Shrek? But also like, um, Incrediboy from hit, hit Pixar movie Incredibles? First, I wasn't sure if it was just the glare. But now that I know it's you, what are the odds? And to think, <laughs> I almost went for coffee instead. But it's really I you! Shining forehead of Winnipeg! Blindest yeah, streamer yeah. on Twitch! It's almost like it was meant to be. Agreed. It's destiny. You changed your routine? Oh, yes. Normally, I start my day by drinking four cups of coffee and stuffing my face with chunks. No way, me too! After being inspired by your story, I thought to myself, what would the great and powerful hero of Vectera do? And so instead, I went for a jog. 
I ran and I ran and I ran, picturing you in the distance, like a North Star. Imagine my surprise <laughs> to find you were actually real <laughs> by the light of Polaris. It must be fate. I hate that term so much. Moog's day today started with her blowing chunks into the toilet. <laughs> that is so disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was yesterday morning. I'm fine today. I told you that. That is so gross. Agreed. This is clearly know, destiny. Right. And you can try to fight destiny. Gotta entertain it, right? You probably aren't going to win. Although, if I'm being honest, I'd wager you could beat just about anything, even theoretical concepts. But why would you? In this case, either way, it's such an spoilers. Odd this guy's face looks ugly as heck. Hey, Jay Felk, how's it going? <laughs> Jay, do you mind are you going to TwitchCon? Sorry, are you going to 596Con? What am I saying? You're a hero, of course, you do. Lead the way. You're gonna be my sidekick, won't you? Need a costume. Good point. I'll start working on it right away, as soon as I learn how to sew. Until then, maybe I can be a sidekick in training. Do you have an academy where fans can practice uh, groveling at your feet? If not, I can start one. Huh? What did he just say? Look, do what you want to do. It's called Tier 3 Subs! <laughs> we ain't got any of those! <laughs> Welcome aboard. Won't be disappointed. Now go to the ship. Brings our assignments between your ships and outpost. Sarah's her companion. Tesco's been left at home. Who has a crush on Sarah? Just a little bit. Look at her. She's adorable. Don't, don't back up. I hate that they do that. Let me love you. <laughs> I also miss Tesco. He's a good buddy. What? Poor Tesco. Tesco's okay. He said that I have to go on this mission alone. With Sarah. A diplomatic visa? Do you mean like a credit card? Mr. Maintenance Man. Bring me a dream. Dun, 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 dun. Tesco's so noble. He is. He felt that I needed to go upon this mission with Sarah. His Are other Captain? friend. Captain who? Check out your ship's inventory. The crazy ship. How may I serve? Why does he look at you like that? You just built your first outpost? That's cool, Razor. I met my adoring fan. You are to go nowhere near my foot, though. I'll tell you that right now, Mr. AF. What the hell? You found the chunk store? Let's see, where do we have to go? 
Are these all the things we have to do? What's our quest does? The eye. What is the eye? Guess could say. Cade, I th I think you would like this game. However, I think that it would be a maybe a little bit too big. No, I have to go... Sol. Where is Sol? No! Oh, peace. No. It is Fallout vibe, but in space. But it is massive. Already. I mean, look how far I'm, I'm literally going just for this quest. Oh, right, I forgot you can do that. Welcome to UC Space. I do think you'd like it, though, Cade. Wait, is this Mars? I gotta play it on PC, though. Ugh. Just go buy a Xbox. Look on eBay. Unless any tier threes want to get me back. Hold of you to assume we have any tier threes here. <laughs> Exit the ship. <laughs> I forgot we weren't wearing our spacesuit. Holy sh! <laughs> I want to wear the chainsaw man, but it's not as good. How much is the newest Xbox in Canadian? Uh... I don't remember. Suit integrity? What's wrong with our suit? How come its integrity has been upset? I can't believe I get to stand near you, breathing the same air. This was a mistake. You stole your first ship? Um, have you been to this planet yet, Razor? Because it said that my suit's integrity has been gone- has gone down. Can I fix it? Mass, okay. I took quest from the job board and I'm far away from Seoul. Learned how to serve. Oh, okay, okay. It took you five hours to figure it out. Is that what you were telling me that you can help me with so I don't have to spend five hours serving? It's so dumb. Okay, so what's wrong with. Is our suit not good enough to be here? I'm, a, I'm, I'm rather confused. We're on Mars, chat. Okay, now it seems fine. Wait, why is it telling me to go here? Am I on the wrong planet? Uh, why are you so close to me? Razor, you also figured out only up in one hour. Oh, I have to go there. No, frick off. Let me look in. Wait a second. This is our planet! Uranus is here! Venus, Jupiter, Neptune, Earth! Don't tell me. 
Whoa. What happened to her? And that's the schmoon. Whoa. Temperature cold. Is it because the sun blew up? Obviously not. It's still hanging out. I'm very excited to learn the lore of this. In my ship, I have a ton of dead bodies. I hope you can clean them out. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, I, there's so much I want to know. <laughs> Alright, back in the ship we go. Bing bong. Shut up. <laughs> it was a mistake. I want to fire him already. Okay. Wait. I haven't discovered it. Oh, so I do have to run over there. Why is it telling me to, to, to do that? Yeah, exactly. Never mind, I don't want to do that. No, oh, spades, that back. Damn it. You can set up this thing called a transfer container to mine resources and get them right to your ship, trying to figure out how to make it actually work. Oh. Well, that sounds neat. No, I didn't mean to do this. God damn it. No. Come back. Frick. Why is it trying to make me go back in the ship? Like, I have to go that way. Solar radiation. Oh, I know it's beat booping. I don't understand what this f quest is trying to get me to ask about the do do do. I understand this. However, you're not allowing me to go there. What do you want me to do? Huh? I still have to check out my inventory. Oh, there's so much to do. <laughs> what do you want me to do? I, I can't go over there. Look, you're just being a piece. What is this? Can I not zoom out? Holy Jesus. Where is this quest? Right there. Okay. Click. You haven't discovered. How am I supposed to discover it if I can't, one, fly there, two, fast travel there, three, walk there? You know what? I don't care. I think this is main story quest anyways. I want to go to these planets. Let me, let me have a look. Can I set the course? Where's the big red dot? Isn't there a big dot on Mars? It's like a crater. Hmm. What is this? Pluto.
What is that? Nova what? Nova Galactic Star Yard? I want to come here. I'd like to- I'd like to join Earth. Oh! I can just- I- I- I can just come to Earth just cuz? What? Why? Oh, there's nowhere to land though, so probably not. What happened to her? I the, hey that that's uh that's South America, look chat there's the USA it's right here. Right. Look I'm right here look that's where I am. Why not there's nowhere to land though. What happened? Oh boy. You can set the landing target just press A. Sandy desert. San you can just land anywhere. Frozen plant. Let me go to... I'm going to Earth! It's all Saudi Arabia, it seems. I'm shook. I'm shook. I'm shook. I'm shook. Whoa. What happened to her? All right, chat. So this is good old Winnipeg. Okay, solar radiation. Did the sun get too hot? Is that why? <laughs> wow, straight up? Ain't nothing. I can make an outpost on Earth? That doesn't sound like a good idea. gold bond ad this is what happens when you don't moisturize wow nothing's left on earth damn son all right let's get the hell out of here that's sad oh you're not aiming at the ground you're looking around okay i'm aiming at the ground Scanner is meant for you to look around. Unknown. You think we'll die? I guess there's only one way to find out, innit? I like how we're supposed to be going to some planet and we've just managed to come to Earth. Uh, Winnipeg, to be exact. Wow. Starting to interfere with my instruments. Typical Winnipeg. Typical Winnipeg. What the hell is that? A resource. What is it? Ah! Neat. What else is there? That's really far, huh? But it's unknown, so I want to go see it. What direction are we heading, though? That I'd like to know. Because if I'm going north, I mean, it only gets colder. I mean, if you land just outside of Winnipeg, there's practically nothing. You're not wrong.
I reckon this is probably the first place that people go to. You, those you walk up on the press A move. I see, I see. Chlorine. Hydrogen and helium. Lithium, beryllium. Boron, carbon, air. Nitrogen all through the air. There's oxygen so you can breathe and fluorine for your pretty teeth. Neon to light up the sky. Sodium for salty times. Magnesium, aluminum, and silicone. Phosphorus and sulfur, chlorine and argon. Something I forget after argon. I don't, I don't know what's after that. I I it left my brain after that part. Is there lots of shooting stars? Okay, we're about halfway there. <clears throat> Living on a prayer. You found a Drippa store on New Atlantis? Really? Okay, we're almost there. I, all I found was a baguette and a macchiato. Typical. I'm curious what kind of creatures are going to be in Canada. Polar bears? Mutant moose? As I peepo explored. Well, I'm up in here exploring Earth. Or what is left of Earth. I like this sand sound, to be fair. Although, I wish there was a radio. I'm kind of missing out on the radio aspect of everything. Can I level up? I do have two skill points. I like the idea of having persuasion. Hmm. Should I actually try to start using a gun gun? Tech. Advanced lock. Unlock ship targeting functionality. Utilized boost packs? I don't really care. Probably a Yaokai. Okay. That works. Ten more oxygen? Sure. We're almost there. I'm kind of nervous. Unexplored geophysical feature. Lead. Okay. That. So what? Did I miss the pog? Oh no, it's still this way. Isn't it? What are these? They're not showing me what they are. Hello? No. Hmm. Hong Kong, dang see. Earth seems like it sucks now, chat. I don't know. What is this? Scottish accent. An iron meteorite. Alright. That's interesting. Five whole minutes of a Scottish accent. Let me eat my last strawberry first.
Well, corrosion probably isn't great. I mean... I guess them saying that they had to leave Earth means that there's probably nothing on Earth. So there's probably no point in us being here. <laughs> I just really wanted to see Earth, to be honest. <laughs> oh, hey, how's it going? I'm not stalling. I'm exploring. I have to see my ship's inventory. I don't know how to do that. Our suit is really not happy with us. Character creation, you gross. Chloe's in a sweet talker. Diplomat of origin makes no sense. Ugin game, I like the idea of persuasion. Yeah, only persuasion in order to get what she wants. That's it that's something. Be great to be able to see yourself whenever you want. You don't need to eat. I'm taking away your plate. Your house is full of mirrors. No, it's not. What time is it anyway? 2.30. It's dentist time. Where is our storage? Razor! How do you get to your storage in your ship? How do you see it? Jump seat. Cargo hold. Is it that? Is that to make an outpost? Go to inventory. Right. Nope, that's the wrong thing. <laughs> inventory? Alright. And then what? Uh, left button. I see. Aid. Ship parts. <laughs> I said ship, by the way. <laughs> All. Alright, so we just got a bunch of shite. That's nice. Alright, let's, let's go find another planet to go on. Which planet is most like- are we most likely to go visit? Should we be able to? I see. So they call it Sidonia, but is this just a city on Mars? Isn't it too gassy on Uranus? I mean, isn't it a gas planet? That's what I mean. Cause it's a gas planet, don't make it weird. explain the brownouts. So what's this going to run? If there are no other surprises, mid five figures. Five figures? Five? Building Sidonia completely underground was a clever way of keeping the city shielded from the harsh Martian landscape. Interesting. <laughs> she drops it quite low. I must say. I love these, look. They move the way you do. My buddy Benji keeps asking if I can help him out with something, but I just don't have the time. Yeah, do you have any idea how far he's traveled? How much money he spent to hitch a ride to this dusty red rock? Hey, don't be mean to Mars. Mars never did anything to you. Don't we all, sister? <clears throat> what? Are you listening to something? No, oh, you're not. Yes, what? Oh. Been serving drinks here for over 40 years. The place is gonna offer that kind of stability. How old are you? What do you mean for 40 years? Ever, Sir, you don't look a day over 40. What's good to drink around here? 
I make it a point not to sell crap. Okay. We got beer, wine, and spirits. Wine! We don't do too many fancy mixed drinks, at least not the kind you get in Neon or New Atlantis. It's my belief that the only booze worth drinking doesn't need to be mixed with something else to taste Jesus. it. Jesus. Like a drink. What's your poison? Wine. Where's the wine? What is a beer teeny? <laughs> Ew, beer and vodka? That's disgusting. Whiskey, pale ale. I don't see wine. You're a, you're a fraud. What do you mean? You don't have wine. You liar. Oh. Nope, that's still beer. Mass produced. You're a liar. You don't have single wine. No, no wine at all. I'm very upset. Vodka. Looking for a vanguard named Mara. Went off on patrol. Hasn't been back in since. We're starting to think that last one was a reserve. I don't care what it was. It wasn't wine. I don't go to sleep. See you, Firefox. Have a good sleep. Lots of love. You have a good weekend too. What the hell's going on out there? You know his root? Me, I've heard it. After about round three or four, was all he would talk about. He's got a voice that carries. I don't know what's going on, but. Yeah. And so it Marshall. begins. Especially when it's missing. But. <clears throat> He has a tab, and you don't know if he's coming back. It's a lot of credits, okay? I'm, I'm not I sure I like that it time. zooms he's in regular. on the character that's talking, or the I'm NPC that's talking. Money. Just because it makes it look like everybody's talking to you, you when they in fact could be talking to each other. Companion can speak on your behalf. What they will say is written next to their name. No, I've done this routine. Let's skip to the part where you admit you're lying about what he owes. You call me a liar? I'll throw both of you out of this bar right now. Oh, please. Two strangers arrive from Offworld asking for information only you have. You see an opportunity. Everyone always does. Lower the price. Don't think we can't find another way to get what we want. Fine. Damn. Could need your help. Shouldn't put a price on that. Life on Sidonia ain't hard enough. <laughs> you gonna guilt trip me? Yep. Oh, <gasps> okay. I know you'd like to help me if you could. What matters more, the money or this life? Yeah. I'll get your point. Promise this is just between us. Maybe. Need to think about it. All right, I'll give Let's up. go. Just trying to earn a living. That's here. how you persuade, Last baby. Time. Here, Moera kept yelling about the Lady of Love. Lady of Love. Songs. Like Do you have radios on this planet? <laughs> That's only one planet. Hardly an entire patrol route. I got what I got, okay? Oh, the planet I'm Venus. I'm your I'm Venus. You. I'm your fire. Your desire. All right, off to Venus, Venus we go. Mars isn't no, it's not. Would we ask, can you, wait, what's the likelihood that we could actually sustain life on Mars? Is there a high chance that, like, you actually could if you, you know, pogged out and put some effort in? <laughs> Thanks for doing that, Sarah. 